briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1982, Fred Duvall hired his childhood friend, attorney Ike Allen Laws Jr., to represent him in a theft case. Duvall was unable to pay the $5,000 fee in full, so he made an alternative deal and conveyed mineral rights to 160 acres of land in Pop County, Arkansas, with the option to repurchase within a year. Fast forward to 1987, Laws leased the mineral rights for $12,740, prompting Duvall to sue him, claiming that the transaction was an equitable mortgage. The Arkansas Court of Appeals in 1990 heard the case, Duval v. Laws, Swain and Murdoch, Pennsylvania, which focused on determining whether the transaction was a mortgage or a sale based on the party's intentions. The court initially ruled that the transaction was a deed with an option to purchase, awarding Duval $2,498. However, Duval appealed the decision, and Laws cross-appealed, leading to further court proceedings. Ultimately, the court determined that the transaction was a sale with a buyback option and upheld the chancellor's decision as not clearly wrong. Laws had to prove fairness and justice, which the court found satisfactory. Although the decision was upheld in direct appeal, it was reversed on cross-appeal, and no damages were awarded to Duval. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.